But there is some new hope this morning. Thousands of doses of the coronavirus vaccine could be on the ground in Arizona within a matter of days. Now, this is all, of course, pending final approval from the FDA. T12's Jen Wall joins us live from Phoenix. So, Jen, any idea where they are in the process with all of this? Yeah, good morning to you guys. So we're talking about Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine this morning. The FDA advisory panel is now giving it a green light, but it still needs that final FDA approval, which could come as early as today. Now, here's what we know so far. The advisory panel is an independent committee made up of experts from outside of the Food and Drug Administration. It's been evaluating the evidence and ethics around Pfizer's vaccine. And yesterday, the group voted 17 to 4 to recommend the vaccine. Now, once final approval is given by the FDA, doctors could start giving the first doses of the vaccine in the United States by next week. Here's what Pfizer's senior VP of vaccine research had to say about the efficacy of the vaccine. We performed an interim analysis at 94 cases in individuals without prior infection and observed efficacy of 95.7%. We have now also performed the final vaccine efficacy evaluation against COVID-19 occurrence from seven days after dose two in 170 cases without prior evidence of, uh, evidence of prior infection. Observed efficacy is high at 95% with high confidence based on the parameters shown in the two right-hand columns. There is 95% probability that efficacy falls in the interval shown, meaning over 97.5% likelihood that efficacy is greater than 90%. Likewise, the probability that vaccine efficacy is at least greater than 30% greatly exceeds FDA COVID-19 vaccine guidance. End of the month, State 48 is set to have almost 400,000 doses of the vaccine, which could be a huge turning point for all of us in this pandemic. Stay with 12 News for updates for now. We're live in Phoenix. Jen Wall, Today in AZ.